Hello world people and welcome back to Planet Zoo. We're starting a zoo from scratch in franchise mode and this is actually episode 28. Oh my goodness. So I'll leave a link to episode one if you want to watch them all from the start. But I don't know what today's plan is. Hopefully we're going to get to five stars. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. We need to get our education rating up. Uh, education rating is a pain in the butt. So, uh, yeah, we'll see if we can get that up a bit. But today, yeah, I don't know what we're going to do. I do need to build a better savannah, I feel. We're going to hopefully add some more animals in. I do have quite a lot of conservation credits now as well, which is wicked. So last episode, we actually ended up adding in these beautiful gorillas. So we added, added a little bit. I can't eat orc. These beautiful gorillas who are massive and so realistic, it's insane. Um, yeah, it's crazy. So I'm not quite sure how we can get our education rating up, I'm not going to lie. I did want to get to... I really wanted to get to five stars, but it's proving really tricky. I've never actually, I've never ever ever, um, got to five stars in my life actually, so I, I don't really know. I'm just going to click on this educator and see, apparently there's more... Like, you can do... Apparently they can, like... What's this? Oh. I don't know. Yeah, apparently they'll go around and talk, like, to people randomly now. Like, just out and about. Which I think is really clever. Oh no, what's going on? Quick pause. Something's going on. Who has welfare issues? Oh no, pronghorn? What's wrong with the pronghorn? Oh, don't tell me it's the water. It's going to be the water, isn't it? I mean, it could be that there's loads of poo in here. There's quite a bit of poo in there. Uh, let's just check the water for them. It's going to be one of those. Oh, no, it does cover. Okay, maybe it's poo then. Okay, we need more. We need more stuff then. I need something that says uh, keeper. That would be great. Oh, no. I'm just going to get a load of keepers here because I feel like maybe we don't have enough. I'll just get a load more stuff, actually. Now I can afford them. Yeah, this is gonna be good. Okay. Oh, God. oh, and loads of things are diseased now. Oh no. Okay, I'm just putting loads of stuff down. <laughs> Don't think we need a vendor particularly. Uh, let's go to the veterinarian. It does mean because of all this new stuff, we're gonna need some new. We're gonna need a new staff zone. Uh oh. Oh, we'll just build it here. Ah! As if I'd done this on purpose. Look at this. But I do want to kind of complete this game now so then we can go on and we can go and build some fancy pants enclosures. That's my whole plan, guys. Big keeper's hut there, that will do. We'll have a research doodah just there, we'll be fine. And then we need um, a staff centre. I think this is, I mean, I'd like a big staff centre, but I'll just stick another one in. It'll be fine. Like so. Cool. Um, I think that's probably enough. Oh, uh, for now maybe. Hmm. Put a trade centre there. Let's put in a surgical doodah. Okay, we've got another little staff zone here, so that that's hopefully will keep people happy for a while. I have 36 animals. I don't understand. What's going on? I don't know. I don't know what's going on. I wish I could go see what you could do in Zoo Tycoon, you go around and pick the poo up yourself, you see. So what's going on here? Okay, let's upgrade the food quality. It's bedding. Bedding? They need bedding? Okay, um, well let's do that. I did not know that I had not put bedding in. That is terrible. Wild lady, it's terrible. Okay, let's go here. Let's just put some bedding. Have I just completely missed the roof? Uh, kind of, yes. <laughs> Whoops. Put some bedding under here. Hopefully that'll sort of do it. Okay, we've got some like... Okay, we've got a bit of bedding or whatever there. Okay, that'll probably do them. Okay, let's just see if that's like... Has it, oh, it's changed. Oh, great, okay. Um, let's see one's a press point. Okay, this zookeeper guy does not seem to be like... Oh my goodness, maybe we need to sell some of the... Some of the animals. Maybe there's too many animals in here or something. Oh my goodness, what has happened? I have so many animals. Gee whiz. Gee whiz. Okay. I've got an inspector coming. I've got loads of bison. There's a lot of bison here. <laughs> oh dear. Yes, these guys really aren't happy with the habitat. 
Oh no. It's just... The Kazukiba needs to like, clean it up. The poop. That's what's going on here. Hmm, strange. Oh no. Who? Oh no. Well, I don't understand. Okay, I'm just gonna just filter through everything. Because we have babies everywhere, which is obviously a great thing. But at the same time, it's a bit stressful. Okay, oh, my cheetahs. Gosh, that was a while ago. Do you remember when we put cheetahs in? These guys are so old. The guy, these guys haven't... They've bred like one cub. That's it. Okay, so let's keep working through his, here. So we've got some ostriches. We've got some piggies. Not loads of piggies, though. Got one snake. We've got... Oh, we've got a baby bear. I don't know when the baby bear came. But we have a baby bear now. So that's cool. Uh, oh, we've got Um here who can probably go to the wild hopefully some of these peacocks will go as well hopefully we need to make sure actually if we've bred them that um they're gonna have this yeah because i don't want them inbreeding inbreeding bad okay like rowan here but these these guys are not very well oh good this is so stressful so the zoo the one at zoo is the most amazing game but Big butt. <laughs> it's stressful. You can't just like enjoy it. Do you know what I mean? Alright, I'm gonna release those things for a while for a minute. Okay, um, I haven't even finished. I need to go check those pronghorny doodars. <laughs> because uh, they're the ones I think causing a problem. Okay, let's sell some of the spiders before they attract protesters. Because they probably will. Yeah, I mean, it gets to a point where it gets so stressful. Um, yeah, so it's just like managing the zoo is bedlam. Anybody here, have you like got so full with the zoo? It's just too stressful. Oh, look at this little guy, it's so cute. I forgot we bred a grey or a white. A white zebra. Okay, maybe you can go to the wild. Can you go to the wild? Um, this one can also possibly go to the wild. Hopefully, we can then make some space. Hopefully. We'll see. Okay, this is this is better. We just need more education stuff. I don't know how to get the education up. I would like to buy some chimps though. Oh, but there aren't any. So what's the next animal for today's episode? We could try bonobo. See if there's any bonobos. No, there's no bonobos. Well, there's male bonobos, but uh, we could also try that really horrendous like monkey thing. Mandrill, that's it. It just looks mean. Yeah, the mandrel just looks mean, I think. <laughs> I don't like it. Oh no. I just don't understand what's wrong with this one. What is wrong? Oh, you can go in the... You can go in the vat? What? When, since when could you do that? I don't understand. I don't understand. Oh, well, the, the guy's in there. Oh no. Right, let's go back to the... Where is the enclosure? Right here. Let's go back to here and just see if I can, like... Oh, protesters, they're gonna ruin my stuff. They're gonna ruin it! Indian peafowls are disgusting. Um, yeah, the protesters are gonna ruin my four and a half star that I nearly have here. Actually, I nearly, I'm slightly over four and a half star. Right, so what can I do to get this up? So I need guest happiness rating. Does that mean like... I'm not sure. Oh my goodness, there's so many. I just don't know. Oh, okay, we need to probably go to research vet research let's have a look here oof so ah okay right oh, i've woken up chloe's woken up okay i have woken up okay hopefully they'll research this thing and can i put you on that i can't i can also put you on that let's put you on this one instead put felix there let's put the camels on there and then this on there yeah okay cool Crikey, is it? There's so many animals I have as well that I haven't even done like loads of research for yet. <gasps> even the chimps! The chimps! Okay, I'm gonna put the chimps here. Oh my goodness. This is crazy. Common warthog has matured. Hey, buddy. Uh, okay, you're, uh, you're clearly fighting, which should not be happening. And you have also aged up, so let's send you off to the wild too. Oh wow, there's loads of people. There's everybody is here today. Say hello, we get some conservation critics for that. Cool. Mechanic research is done. Gosh, this is so stressful. 
What's wrong with this? Facility inaccessible, no linked tables. Oh yes, I remember this now. Okay, yeah, we need to put in some tables. I'll just type in table. Uh, I can hear someone, I think I can hear somebody fighting. I'm not sure who it is. Oh, there's tables all there. Uh, okay, well what I'll do is I'll go, can I link, how do I link tables? Yeah. Oh, you don't count? Oh, well, that sucks. That's annoying. Okay, well let's see if I can like expand this path out a bit. And I highly doubt it. Okay, that, that might work actually. This mind mm, there's going to be no grid there. There's going to be no grid there. Okay, that will have to like... It's really bodge jobby, but it'll it'll do. Okay, it'll do. Oh, okay, it'll do. Um, sorry guys, my chair is so squeaky and I think it just can't take my big one. Okay, here we go. Let's just put some like chairs and stuff all around here. And hopefully people won't moan. Okay, let's link some seating. Link tables. Okay, confirm link. And then we need to do the same with this one. So let's link some tables. One, two, three. Okay, confirm link and unlink and that kind of thing. Cool. Bet research is now complete too. That's great. <laughs> Okay, we need uh, Felix to hurry up and uh, get that disease sorted out. Oh, who's hungry? This little spider's hungry. He's not little actually, is he? He's massive. Ooh, it's actually horrendous. Hey, Zebra's about to have some babies. That's great. Okay, right. I want to go and get a new animal into the zoo. Let's do that before anything else happens. And it's gone dark now, which is like really helpful. I can't actually see a thing. I'm just going to fast forward stuff. Uh oh. I should not fast forward things. Kids over here. Wait, which stuff? What are you wanting to use? The medical bit. Oh, okay. Um, Let's go get another medical facility somewhere else. Let's get rid of the word table. Oh, I don't want that either. Uh, where can we put medical centers? Should we just put. Oh, I have put one in there. Well, they could come and use this one. That's annoying. Oh, 16 animals now stressed. Oh no, what's wrong? Cleanliness, oh. Okay, well let's get, let's get some, somebody over there, this is so stressful. I want a new animal, guys. I just want a new animal. Okay, that's fine. Okay, <laughs> quick. Um, where are we gonna build the next enclosure? Should we just get, make this a little bit thicker so people aren't going to get clogged hopefully that's fine yeah we don't want people getting clogged down here because otherwise it's an absolute nightmare okay that'll probably yeah that'll probably do and then what we'll do is we'll just put in another enclosure here but now i can't see a thing which is great i wish i could change the sun i wish i could change the sun but i can't so that's really helpful I don't know how big I'm going to make this enclosure either. We'll see. Let's just carry on around here. Lime timber. One of the timber wolves is about to age up. Oh my goodness. This is the problem. Oh no, one of my giraffes is about to. Oh no. One of my giraffes is about to die of old age. That's really sad. How much space do I need for the monkeys? I don't think I need that much space. Let's just get the path a second and just see if we're going to line a grid like this one. Hopefully that will work. Like this. Go along here like that. Oh, what have I done? Probably not a lot. Oh, right, there's a fence there. I can't see because it's so dark, which is really helpful. Oh, it's annoying. It's so dark. Come on, maybe I should turn the light on. I mean, that would maybe have helped. Hey! Okay, here we go. Okay, we are back. It is not dark anymore. Hopefully. Okay, let's do this. I just want to build an enclosure. I just want to build an enclosure. That's all I want to do. All I want is to build an enclosure. Cool. Okay, well, it's a bit wonky, but <laughs> it'll do. It'll do. It'll do. Okay, let's go to the end here. Let's just do that. I don't know why it suddenly went really wide, but... Ah, well... Okay, we can like fill out to the bottom here, like so. 
all the way along here like so what's that american vikings that had an offspring oh look it sorry guys a terrible terrible american accent sorry if you're from america I, why are you obstructed i don't understand okay cool i don't know if that would actually oh ooh, i just pressed the wrong thing right what is the problem here let's go along here Great. Okay. Okay. I finally have some form of enclosure. Doesn't look too bad. It'll do. <laughs> It'll do. Let's just put a little, yeah, a little door there. That'll be fine. Okay. Let's go see what animals we can afford. This is my favourite bit of the game. Oh, there's a there's a female chimp. Oh, there's a female bonobo. I don't really know much about bonobos. What are they? Well, obviously they're monkeys or apes rather. Um, okay, well, we've already had a gorilla, so oh, I don't know what to go for. Kind of want something that's in the... Oh no, hang on, someone's about to inbreed. No, you guys should not be doing this. It's that little, it's that little white one. I haven't actually, this is my first white one I ever bred. Off you go, go and cause chaos somewhere else. Oh my goodness, look at this. Oh no, Springbok are fighting and everything. This is just crazy. Great, okay, we have somebody spare maybe to just do some research on our... Uh, let's actually just do some of the, the bugs and diseases and things. Um, average animal welfare is okay. It's not like, it's not 100% though, is it? Our marketing could go up. Let's do something with our marketing. Okay, hunger and thirst could go up. An education rating is not great. Oh no. Okay. Oh, crikey. Okay, so do we need more education, like, here? Ooh. What about if I just get a big board? I think it kind of works like this. I'll just get a big... Not that big. That's silly. Something like that. Like, yeah, I'll just put it, like, boom, right in the middle. And I can put one there as well. Just cover those window toilet windows up. And I can just put in some, like... Stuff about bee decline and things like that. I think that'll be fine. Is that is that gonna work, do you think? Where is where is there we go. Like we could also have another big screen thing. Whoa, that's a huge screen. Do not need that. Maybe we could just put one like there, maybe. There are conservation boards everywhere. Maybe we should need maybe we should put one here too. I'm just gonna put them everywhere. I don't even know if that's going to help. It looks really wonky, that one as well. So that's going to annoy me. It's going to really annoy me. Where is the... I keep going straight past it, that's why. Donut. We do need some more, like, vending machines and stuff like that. It looks like people are getting quite thirsty. And they're hungry as well. Oh, a pizza. A pizza mach vending machine? Really? Is that a thing? Cool. I didn't even know that was a thing. Cool, let's put, like, a pizza vending there with a drinks thing and let's put like uh some fries why would they not let me put anything else there we could put some fries there okay that'll do i i don't know if that's gonna make any difference at all but you know we'll see <laughs> i don't know where to put more education stuff i suppose i could just go around with those education board thingies and just hope and pray they work we could we could do that Right, look at this little enclosure over here. He's like, oh, I'm still waiting for somebody to come into the park right now. Let's see. Okay, this is 618. Mm, it's not very much room, actually. Probably need something small. I tell you what, let's get a tortoise today. I love them so much. Because they are rainforest animals. Oh my gosh, do I really want to spend 500 pounds on a tortoise? Uh, let's look at the, al how do you say it? Algebra? Algebra? <laughs> Okay, let's look at all the little animals that are from the rainforest. Let's go to the Superior for a second. Who is from the rainforest? So we want them from... Uh, yeah, let's go Africa. And then we want... I don't really know. Habitat will be fine. Conservationist trick. Oh, let's see who's critically endangered. Oh, a lemur. Oh, we can have lemurs. I don't know how much room they need, though. What about if we had, like, ten of them? Okay, they, okay, we could get some lemurs. Let's see how much lemurs are. 
that's a good idea. Okay, begins with Lee. Lee? <laughs> uh, uh, yeah, so we can get the red ruffled lemur as well as the ringtailed lemur. Let's have a look and see how much they are. Ooh, quite affordable. Oh, they're expensive. <laughs> they're expensive, and these are not. Okay, well, let's get, um... Hmm. This one's not too bad. Let's get this one, and let's get this one. So we've got a red ruffled lemur. Um, I might just buy this female. I know she's not great, but we have, like, more than one female then. Uh, the male's fine, but we might be able to get some more. I think they are going to cost us some conservation credits. There's not many lemurs today. What's going on with that? strange okay well red ruffled lemur it is then maybe we could have a corridor of lemurs <laughs> that's my great plan for today okay over to animal trading let's go and crikey you should have been sold ages ago okay i'm just gonna trade i'm just gonna release into the wild yep why not um i know you can get more for con you know for the other thing whoa suddenly we have loads of male lemurs what's that about okay uh, but let's go to animal storage. Why do I have so many animals in animal storage? I did not put them there, I swear to you guys. I have two I have two chimps, but I need another female chimp. Hmm. I bought some chimps last time and I completely forgot. Whoops. You guys probably needed to remind me of that. <laughs> like, uh, Chloe, Chloe, what are you doing, man? Come on. Uh, let's see how much the chimps are. This could be a double whammy today. We bought some lemurs at least, some red ruffled ones, whatever they're called. Oh, there's a female, quick, buy it. Oh, I bought it. Oh, sweet, but we're going to need loads more space. So tell you what, let's make the enclosure for the lemurs today. And then what we're going to do is in the next episode, we will make something for our chimps, maybe. We'll see. We will see. Okay, I need to make sure that this is non-climbable. Because the monkeys, the lemur thingies, they're gonna get out. Otherwise, they are gonna get out. Whoop! It's very high. It's so high. Let's go both sides and let's go. Um, let's go this way. Cool. Great. Okay. Uh, hopefully, this will be enough space. I don't know. Let's just check and see where our like water cleaning stuff reach. Oh man, that's annoying. I wonder if I can just like budget over an inch. Uh, yeah, let's grab this. See the the thing with Planet Zoo is it's so detailed. Like, it's, it's can I can I just put you out here a little bit, a little bit more? Would it would it reach all the things I want it to reach? Yes, it will. Okay. I mean, it's a bit awkward it being there. Um, hmm. Hmm, that's probably not my best idea I've had. What if I can like put it there? Well, the water needs to like touch there. <laughs> this is gonna be dodgy. This is gonna be real dodge. Okay, let's just take away the size. Okay, we're just gonna put a teeny weeny bit there. Put a tiny bit of water. We'll do. Uh, I don't think I even need that much space actually. Yeah. That will do. That will do. And I'm hoping, let's just check the clean. Oh, thank goodness. Look at that. It just reaches. Oh. Okay. Where are my lemurs? Come on, guys. Come on, zookeepers. Where are you? Oh, I haven't pressed play. That'll be why. <laughs> That'll be why. What a donut. I love having, oh no, animals died. How many animals have died? What? Or is it just, oh no. Who's crocodile? <gasps> the crocodiles are fighting. That's not good. I love crocodiles. I love them. I love making enclosures for crocodiles. I just love crocodiles. I wish we could have lots and lots of crocodiles in the zoo here, but unfortunately, they do fight, which is not helpful. Okay, let's go to the crocodiles then. Let's see what's going on here. It's so cute. Um, oh, you can go. Let's just, I'd like to release you to the wild. The wild. Okay, I would like to achieve some of these, like, rewards as well today oh look at these camels camels okay what was i doing oh my gosh i was just looking at things and then i got distracted um i was gonna go find something i can't remember what oh we we don't have any giraffes left okay we need to buy some giraffes well, i'll take her off of that 
and then hopefully well not hopefully but the dad might die by then because he's old and then we can get a new male giraffe in maybe that might work oh the crocodiles that's what i was doing look at the size of this guy wow let's release you to the wild we have lots of new crocodiles in here look at this little baby one just chilling out cute right look at that look at this the graphics on this game is unbelievable i literally it makes me so happy okay are my lemurs here yet? Have a look at this. So what have we got? Reduce crime. Hopefully we can do that. I've still got to release American bison. Oh my goodness. Adopt and place six different habitat species? Okay. Not today we won't. Well, we might today. I could just buy random ones and top up. Top up the uh, some of the enclosures. Who's in here? I can't remember who's in here. We do have so many animals now. It's brilliant. It's really cool. I've actually never got to this point planet zoo before where the zoo is like packed i used to be obsessed with zoo tycoon do you guys remember that from years ago oh it was wonderful so actually i think why don't we get to animal train let's see how much uh giraffe are let's see if we can get some female giraffe so um annoyingly last episode i didn't obviously show you guys this but uh as soon as my i finished with the game i tried to get a screenshot for the you know youtube and stuff and it froze and I lost all my, I had to like rebuild the, uh, the enclosure and stuff for the, for the chimpanzees and the, uh, gorillas, for the gorillas. Oh, my lemurs are here. Okay. Let's just, not get too distracted. Let's just see how much giraffe are. Maybe I can, okay, there's one giraffe. Let's just adopt her now while we can. And then let's just, uh, let's just find her and send her to the zoo. Send to zoo. Let's go here. Okay, cool. We have a giraffe coming. That's great. Uh, it looks like our lemurs are here somewhere. There they are. I find these ones so cute. Look how fluffy that is. It's so fluffy. It's so fluffy. I could die. Isn't it cute? It's so cute. Okay, we do also need to put some drink stuff in. Oh, space. Oh, no. I thought... This is why I get confused. Um, I just got loads of space. It just needs climbable things okay let's go by species this is called the something red something oh okay literally a red ruffled lemur okay i can cope with that i hope i can cope with that red ruffled lemur cool okay okay let's go with some like little uh they're gonna need quite a lot of we could put it right in the middle actually like right bam in the middle and then what we need to do is get some put some stuff on top you see I think it'd be kind of cool it's just a little idea I've just come up with we just put the leaves on top here I think that's quite nice and then we can put some oh we can actually put some straw underneath here try and make it sort of fit I guess here we go okay and then we have loads of cool stuff for them like the forage box look at that is it gonna fit probably not a fruit spike, some cardboard boxes. What other things do we have? Oh, lots of climbable things. So yeah, we can like attach the climbable stuff to the, you know, the shelter and things like that. That's kind of what I was thinking. Uh, yeah, let's put this one. Can I move it? Yes, I can move it. I like to move it, move it. So little things like this. This, I, this is my favorite thing about like lemurs and stuff like that. It's just like really fun building their enclosure. You can do so much, so much. Just kind of like attach that there somehow. So they've got quite a lot of stuff to do there. That's great. And let's put a little ice cubey thing in there. I don't know what this is, a suspended forager. We do need actual food as well, which I always forget about here. <gasps> so close to five star guys. I just need to get my marketing up. Oh my goodness, guys. I feel like we're doing really well. If we get to five stars, I'm going to complete the zoo. <gasps> and then we can like, we can move on. We can do other things. Like we can, we can maybe see how, how fast we can get to five star in, I don't know, uh, sandbox mode and stuff like that. Um, like pretty, like we can make pretty enclosures and stuff like that. And yeah, it'd be fun. It'd be so fun. As long as this goes well, because you never know, we might never make it. We might never make it to five star. Okay, let's, um, can I put like a sprinkler there? Cool. And where's the actual like food tray? Because there should be a food doodah somewhere. There it is. 
Cool, and we can just literally put that... Where are we going to put that? Uh-oh. Put that there. Cool. Okay, I'm happy with that. Now we just need plants and stuff like that for them, which is very fun. I haven't actually put any rocks in here today, which is strange. That's not like me. But let's put all these little smaller ones in. Oh, I'm really excited about this. Hopefully as well, guys, um, I'm going to be doing some... What am I going to be doing? For goodness sake, my brain just goes sometimes. Sorry, guys. I'm going to be doing some Jurassic evolution game because i haven't played in ages and i really need to play it because i'm obsessed with jurassic park like i'm crazy obsessed with it oh i love the palm trees and stuff in this game it's so pretty i love the little ferns and stuff you get we need to make some beautiful enclosures don't we guys i mean i'm not making these right now for beauty i am just doing them for practicality hopefully these lemurs are going to be happy then they can breed make babies and then they can make me money yeah Ugh, it's terrible put a little rock in there oh is that gone the other side oh I'll be all right um what other things can we add in here guys so they have wow you can have so much coverage for these guys that's one of my favorite things about this but you can actually get a mod apparently where you know the amount of foliage you can like edit it so then you can have unlimited in some of these enclosures because some of the animals you, you don't really you can't really put much in there they don't like it which oh, i don't know it's, i don't i think all animals like foliage right i don't know maybe i'm wrong here oh look at this big banana tree should i just put that like right in the middle <laughs> i could do actually let's put a couple of these around these are fun i think oh there's some more of these but different layers of them that's fun okay i think they're happy for now i think it'll be fine uh we've done kind of what we needed to do you can't end up putting too much in what would be kind of cool is making like an ivy whoa what is this that ivy it's massive i don't remember them being this big yeah you can put them like oh that was oh no wait 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 kind of like that where it looks like it's falling down and then it looks kind of more realistic with the I don't think that kind of worked there no no it did not and you get big tamarind trees. Oh, look at this. I think if I put that there, they are gonna... Okay, that's kind of cool. Anyway, I think we've done everything that we need to do. We just need to do all the education-y doodari stuff. Which is obviously my favourite bit. I love the education bit. It's so fun. Okay, let's put a big whack-off education thingy there. Let's put one there. And one there. We could also maybe make it go around the side here, actually. How do I get off this edit barrier? Let's just put that as a two-way glass as well. So people can actually see more. That would be good. But I love playing Planet Zoo. I've probably wasted a lot of my life on this game. <laughs> hey, it's not wasted if you're enjoying it, right? Now I need to put the education stuff like right where the people are going to look. So where are these people going to look, do you think? Probably like right there. And then what we need to do is put a speaker maybe there and there and there for now and then I'm gonna have to try and click on it there we go I think I'm just gonna keep it to ruffled lemurs in here um I was gonna put actual lemurs in here too because they do get on and they do coexist I don't know I might do I'm not sure what do you guys think we should oh, I'm just gonna move this board thing actually this whole thing just kind of there-ish because then it's within that speaker and then let's put some things actually on this. That would be great. Especially here as well. We need a... We need some seating for that too. We need an educator too. Cool. I would love some more... So I'm not a big fan of the education stuff. Even though that's kind of the whole point in wildlife parks and stuff like that. But um, yeah. Okay, let's just move this one like that, because I reckon that'll educate people more. Cool, and that's got that's got something running through. Ooh, I can have custom music. That's cool. I didn't know that. Uh, let's just check the speaker. Oh, because you do not want the speakers to clash. No, no, no. No, 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 no. Don't funk with my heart. Let's just see the range on this. Okay, that'll be fine. And... We need donation boxes. I mean, that's silly. Huh. Do not feed. That's a good idea. Um, I'm puzzled now. Um, what am I doing? Donation boxes. That's right. 
That's what I'm doing. See, when I started this game, I was really like, I was trying so hard to like theme the bin and everything. But now I'm just like, nah, just chuck it in there. It'll be fine. <laughs> cool. I'm really happy with that. Let's just go check out how I can, I always forget how to like, sort out my, ed uh, my marketing. So you go to zoo. I think you go zoo over, over right. We need more, we need more like food stuff. Um, place, re replace. Um, okay, let's go. Do I need security cameras? Maybe. Guests, we have a lot. I can't remember how to do, I don't know, I can't remember how to do marketing. Is it finances? Loans, marketing. Hey, there we go. Um, okay. Ooh, we can begin marketing. Can I, why can I not do this? Uh, let's go stop. Can you only have three at a time? You can. Okay, let's go stop here. Well, we need the big jobs, don't we? Is this high impact? Divides appeal, I don't know what this means. Okay, and then let's take this one off and let's go high impact, family hour. Well, you want family hour, don't you? Okay, that'll be fine. Probably gonna cost us a lot of money, but that's fine. Uh, marketing, okay, I've just changed my marketing. Guest happiness rating is good, but we do need some more drinks and stuff like that. We're so close to five star. <gasps> I've never had a five star zoo before. I actually am buzzing about this. This is crazy. Okay, let's get some drink stuff in here. I'm not really too worried about what they look like right now because, meh, doesn't matter really, does it? Uh, let's get some, where am I gonna put all this actually? I need like a special place just for all the drink stuff. Unless I just go around and put in a load of I don't know, a load of uh, drink stands and things like that. Because I did put loads in down here. Look at this. Oh, wow. We need some bins down here. People are so grubby. I need a bin. That's what I need. Wow, look at this. That's a wind turbine. I actually never, I've never used that on Planet Zoo yet. Let's just stick a load of these random bins in. I don't care what they look like. People need to stop being gross. Cool. Okay, that'll do for now. Right, well there we go guys, what an episode. We managed to get those really cute little ruffle lemur doodars. Let's just see if, oh no, Ponghorn's about to die. Are they happy in here? Let's see how much space they have, because I'm thinking we could actually, we could add in the lemur, you know, the other lemur. <laughs> the other type of lemur, which is a, ooh, loads of giraffe all of a sudden. Hang on, are there any good ones? That one's pretty good. Cool, and then let's just get this one in as well. Why not? I just bought a load of giraffe. Whoops. I just bought loads of giraffe. Um, that wasn't in my plan. But hey, I'm not gonna complain. I mean, who doesn't want giraffe, right? <laughs> okay, let's quickly send those to the zoo. Hopefully we'll have some babies soon. That'd be great. Maybe if the male stays like long enough. We do have enough uh, chimpanzees now as well. So that's great. And then, I did have another animal that I thought I just bought, but let's just have a look and see if there's any ring-tailed lemur. I shouldn't be doing this right now. Oh, there's a female. I should have bought the male when I could. We're just going to buy all of these because why not? And then if a male pops up, then I don't know what to do. Should I add them all into the same enclosure, which is kind of nice. People like the different species together don't they you get like extra points for that yeah i think there's enough room i think we could do that i think that's fine i think it'd be fine i think they'll love it oh the terrain i didn't even check we need to make their terrain okay lady ranger what are you doing lady ranger that's my other name on my other channel i actually call myself by my real name on this channel which is chloe you guys probably already know that i'm called that anyway uh, okay, I don't know what I'm doing anymore. We just want soil everywhere. Woohoo, okay, that'll do. Great, and let's just put a tiny bit of long grass in. I want short grass, actually. Sweet, yay, episode 28, and we've got some lemurs. Let's just see if there's any male lemurs. <laughs> I love lemurs, yes I do. Yes I do, 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 do. Oh, so many animals are dying. Oh no. Chloe the timber wolf. I've had her for years, I swear. What's wrong with you? I don't know what's wrong with this wolf. Welfare. What's wrong with the welfare? Stre 
I'm so confused. Temperature, again? But I put it... I'm so confused, because I literally put in loads... You guys have seen me do this. I have put in loads and loads and loads of... Uh, uh, we didn't have a cat donut. Look at my star sign there, guys. <laughs> yeah, I put in loads of these temperature duty dars. I swear. Okay, well, let's just put this at minus one. Okay, the water's warm, but that's okay. Look, there's another... Sp ah, I know why. It's because when I did it last episode, it crashed and then it didn't save. I remember this now. Okay, how annoying. Oh my goodness, so many of my animals are, like, about to die. This is ridiculous. Oh, I don't know what to do. Let's just check through them all a second. This is crazy. I'll tell you what, I'm going to do all this without you guys having to watch, because you probably find it a bit, like, come on. Uh, let's sell the spider a bit quick. Spiders are definitely the way. If I did the zoo again, I know exactly how I'd do it. I think I wouldn't mind starting another franchise, actually. <laughs> I love them. Oh, you can go off to the wild. Does anybody else can go to the wild? The wild. It always reminds me of Madagascar. Let's just put your contract. Let's release you to the wild, buddy. Cool. Oh my goodness, we're so close to five stars. I just need education rating up. How do I get education rating up? This is so great. Dude. We're so close to five stars. Okay, guys, we'll leave it there today. Thanks so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And thank you for subscribing. If you haven't already, then please do subscribe. Turn on that notification bell. And if you've enjoyed today's video and you love lemurs, then smash that like button for me. I'd really, really appreciate it. Look at these guys in here. Look at them. That coach looks tiny compared to the others. But we're going to wait and see if we can get a ring-tailed lemur male. And then we're going to put them in here, I think, as well. Or I might build them a whole new enclosure. We will see. But here's this little guy here just enjoying enjoying the sprinkler. He's so cute. Look at him. They look like cats to me. I don't know why. I think they look a little bit like cats. Oh, we're now in a bush. But that is it for today's episode, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Have a wild rest of your day. Bye.